Hello and welcome guys, I'm Trucker Rudy and we got an update on the uh, Thermal King deal Yes indeed, we do have some good news for you guys The issue has been resolved now We were at uh, Thermal King this morning and uh, we had a good meeting with them and uh, they fixed my side fairing and all that good stuff Unfortunately, we weren't able to uh, get this matter resolved uh, privately. I had to make a video in order to get this uh, resolved. But I think that will, uh, I think, teach both of us a lesson on uh, all kinds of stuff. So uh, I want to say thank you to Thermo King for, uh, you know, our eventually making it right, anyways. Because. Uh, you know, I, I did really honestly feel that uh, I was overcharged and uh, they did, uh, they did at the end of the day, they did pay me back for the overtime charges that we felt that, uh, that were overcharged for me. And they also did fix my side fairing. They did say uh, they apologized on my uh, video underneath the comments on the previous video that I made where I was quite upset on the whole deal. And I just wanted to say that uh, I haven't really had any issues anywhere else in any other Thermal King uh, places or anything like that. So uh, it was just the one bad experience that I had. But it has been made correct now. And so if anything, I just want to say that uh, if an occasion like this would come up again, I would definitely stand up again for myself and uh, I think in essence what it is is also uh, I'm not just standing up for myself I think I'm also standing up for a lot of other truckers and owner operators out there and stuff like that that uh, have things like these happen to them in the in the past you know and so hopefully looking uh, in, ahead these things are going to be less and less more happening because I think we need to stand up for ourselves sometimes and uh, I mean we, we all have disagreements every once in a while you know and I think at the end of the day if we can all uh, work it out and uh, and uh, stuff like that then uh, I think it takes a real man to uh, to admit their wrongdoing and uh, they did I mean they, they came right out there on public and uh, apologized uh, in the comments there so and as me being a man of my words I said right from the beginning that I was going to make a video when uh, when these things couldn't resolve privately so we did and I also told them that I was going to make a follow-up video and uh, I told them that it's going to take me a couple of days to get this whole video put together but uh, hey, I'm a man on my word, and I'm going to make this follow-up video. And uh, I think it takes a big man to to admit sometimes that we are wrong. I am wrong sometimes too. And uh, the way I look at it is, uh, you know, they made a mistake, and they asked me to give him a second chance, and uh, I did. I did go back there, and I did give him a second chance to fix that and uh, they gave me my money back so it worked out at the end of the day anyways so and that's what i told the guy in the office there too i said uh, if i make a mistake i would want somebody to give me a second chance and so they asked me to give them a second chance and i did so here we are and uh, i do have video footage of that uh, a little bit not too much we didn't videotape a whole lot but we did videotape a little bit and so in this video you're going to see us all standing around our truck and obviously they didn't have much to say and uh, just as we were filming there's an airplane coming over us and uh, so some words were missed on the camera wasn't able to capture them with the mic there but uh, I basically did ask him if they had anything else they would like to say and I think that's the part that got cut out over there from the noise from the airplane and they said no they didn't have anything else to say and then I said well if you guys don't have anything else to say then we will close the video or whatever and uh, so that's the next thing that you will hear after the airplane flies over it but uh, 
but yeah we uh, we got the issue resolved at the end of the day I'm very happy about it I am satisfied with uh, with the work that they have done on my APU unit and also they fixed my side fairing like I mentioned before and so yeah anyways I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna show you guys that they actually did fix my side fairing so let's uh, go ahead and take a look alrighty here we are outside on my truck and as you can see my side fairing is lining up properly the way it's supposed to you can see right here it lines up correctly so just to show you guys that they did do the job that they said that they were gonna do all right guys let's go ahead and watch the video clip where we met up and uh so yeah so you can see for yourself that we did go there and we gave him a second chance and all that good stuff so let's get to the clip all right guys we are here at thermal king this morning and uh, i promised you guys i would uh, i was going to do a uh, follow-up video and uh, thermal king has been very nice to me they have contacted me ever after we have released the video and uh, we are here outside on my truck they have fixed my issue and they have also reimbursed me for uh, the overtime charges that I thought was overcharged and uh, I said I, I said to them I would give them an opportunity to uh, st to talk to us all on camera and uh, and make this right you know make this a positive experience and I, I want to thank you guys for making it right with me guys I appreciate it I thank you very much for uh, for doing service with me and uh, I wanted to say that they never did anything wrong with the uh, alternator or with my AP unit to begin with so that was all done correctly I appreciate that the uh, unit has worked very successfully in my opinion I mean we all do have the odd issue but uh, I want to give these guys an opportunity to speak as well and uh, so the floor is yours whatever you want to say okay Rudy I just like to say thank you for giving us the opportunity to come back and make this right yes um, Chad is uh, our service manager here and I'm sure he feels the same way. Troy's one of our expert technicians. As you can see, you got that picture really quick. All right. All right. Well, if you guys don't have anything else to say, then uh, we, we, just, we just want you to bring your stuff back here and go that. Yes, sir. Uh, I have an airplane going over it, but uh, I would like to say I am happy with the service that they have provided with me. and. Uh, I just want to say thank you guys uh, for working with me and uh, this issue has been resolved guys and uh, I just want to make this a positive experience because uh, there's enough negativity going on in this world yes. and uh, negativity flies so fast as we all know and uh, I think as truckers sometimes you know we, we feel that you know things don't go the way they're supposed to sometimes and, and it's nice when we see people like you guys that are willing to to work with us and, and I think we all need to stand together and, and, and be a stronger stronger group you know as a trucking industry so thanks for taking the opportunity to talk to us well thank you no for giving us the opportunity yeah well there you have it guys yes indeed I just wanted to say that uh, I'm not a greedy person I'm an honest person so some of you guys were saying you know I should take them to court for this and that and whatever you know that's not really me I would try everything within my power to resolve this privately and unfortunately I wasn't able to do that so that's why I made the video and uh, but after that we were able to resolve the issue outside of court anyways so and that's the way I like to do things you know if we can stand up man to man and, and have a, a you know conversation as a man to man I think that's uh, that's the right way to go about it and the guy in the office there he was uh, very professional he uh, you know we we could talk it was no hard feelings against one another so that's the way I like to do it and so I just want to say thanks again to Thermal King uh, out of Millbury Ohio for uh, making it right we appreciate it very much and uh, once I also want to say thank you for all of my subscribers for the support that I've gotten from you guys I know that means a lot to me and also lifetrucking.com had also put a uh, an article on their website I appreciate that too for uh, putting that out there and uh, we are going to update this on our website as well I have already updated it a little bit on telling everybody that the issue has been resolved and uh, so there you go I appreciate you guys watching 
and let's keep up the good work and let's work together and let's make changes when we need to and uh, as you can see we did do some changes here and I am happy I am satisfied with the work that they did so let's keep the wheels rolling and we'll catch you on the next one this is trucker Rudy signing out